Hello and welcome to the world of pride. And I am your host, the one and only Kippy Love. I'm hyper right now because I've been having a lot of chocolate. <laughs> But anyway, um, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, um, I'm gonna have some, I'm gonna have, eat some capers right now. Oh, 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 my mistake. It's not capers, it's copers or coopers? Might be copers. K-O-P-P-E-R-S. And it's copers chocolate. And it's a bite-sized, bite-sized work of art. And these, uh, uh, the company Copers has been around since 1937. And this is, I've got two different kinds. I've got the Copers chocolate with the white, I mean, with the, uh, milk chocolate. And then I have the Copers chocolate with dark chocolate, espresso beans. And what is weird is one, uh, uh, one bag shows, uh, beans on it where the other one doesn't. It's weird. But that's what it looks like. See, this is the milk chocolate version. And, um, it's, uh, got espresso beans. I guess it's like real espresso beans underneath the chocolate. And then the other one is, uh, shows the, the, the beans on there. And this is the dark chocolate version. So we're going to try the um, light chocolate first, the milk chocolate, and see what it tastes like. Can I open it up regular, or do I have to rip it up? Oh, I think I have to rip the bag open. Let me see. Uh-oh. Uh Am I going to be able to open it? It looks like they, they got it stuck together where I can't open it. Let me see if I can open it from the bottom. Uh, 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 uh oh, I'm going to have to get a scissor and cut this bad boy because it doesn't seem like it wants to rip. Nope. It doesn't have a rip thing on the side that I know of. Nope, no rip on the side. So, I'll be right back with a knife. Hello, and I'm back. I had to get a knife. <laughs> you know, that looks weird. I was, I had my tongue sticking out. Now it's going like this, and then I pulled it in so it made it look like I cut it off. Oh. Uh, 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 uh. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and open this up and see what, if I, if I can open it. There we go. See, and they both have a, that sign on here, bite-sized uh, work of art. Yep, right there. So I'm going to open this one up carefully. And I see I'm just going to have two of them. Two little chocolates. See, they look like this. They're chocolates. little pickup truck putting another car down the road.
can't sound as good as the truck, but mmm, but these are delicious. The um, the coffee beans are like majorly roasted, and they got that they harness all that flavor of the bean inside of the roasting part, and they're so they're so roasted to the point that when you bite into it, it's not hard like a like a regular bean. You know, it's kind of they've gotten a little bit softer, but they've harnessed all that flavor of the uh, of the espresso bean in there. You know, the coffee bean. And, uh, and they're like really, really good. It was like light milk chocolate on the outside, but it was like a deep, dark uh, cappuccino bean on the inside. We're going to get two of these chocolate ones, the dark chocolate version. Mm. And we're going to try these next. And here's looking at you, chocolate. Wow. Mmm. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Mmm. Mmm, 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 That's what I'm talking about. Mmm. That one right there was the bomb. That one was the bomb. The milk chocolate was like a, uh, a cream. It's like a, it was like a espresso, a roasted espresso with um like creamer added to the chocolate and the and the espresso whereas the dark chocolate was like no cream in it it was just pure dark chocolate with um espresso beans in it i mean and it's so powerful i mean you actually have the bean in there it's not a piece of candy that makes it sound or taste like it or sound like the crunch. I mean, this is actually espresso beans that have been roasted to the point that they just crush in your mouth. Like, like, um, almost like if you had, uh, 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 uh rice krispies or, 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 um, cornflakes, something like that, where they got that crunch, nice crunch to them. And you can taste the chocolate. And you can taste the espresso beans. They're amazing. I mean, it's all, it, you can't get any closer than that. Than just taking a spoonful of freshly ground coffee. And putting a little chocolate in your mouth. I mean, that's about almost as close as you can get to the actual real coffee in your mouth. With a little bit of chocolate. Mmm. And you can, I, I can actually taste like I'm actually chew, like I actually put cho coffee in my mouth, ground coffee in my mouth. I mean, that's how, what it tastes like. You know, usually when um, I have a cup of coffee and I get a little coffee grounds in there, I'm always like, yeah, yeah, uh, 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 you know, trying to get coffee grounds out. But this is so good. I think I'll go eat a spoonful of coffee grounds, just suck on them for an hour. That'd be good, wouldn't it? But anyway, that's our video. And if you get a chance to get coppers or copers, however it's pronounced, and it's the copers chocolate, and it's the dark chocolate version, the espresso beans, and this one here is the 
milk chocolate with the espresso beans. And like they say on that, on the uh, advertisement, bite-sized, bite-sized work of art. Right there, a bite-sized work of art. Mmm, so good. But anyway, that's our video. Y'all have a possible day and a perfect tomorrow. We'll catch y'all at Scratchy Post where we can meow about bite-sized catnip. Bite-sized work of catnip. Yeah. The art of catnip. Mm, that would be good. Can you imagine being like like skull or 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 some kind of um 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 you know uh Tobacco or something like that that they they always get in their little can and you just take some catnip and mmm that's what I'm talking about right now <coughs> yeah but that would be gross wouldn't it especially when it, when you spit green Ooh. oh anyway I gotta go I get sick anyway bye y'all. <coughs>